Are you experiencing flickering screens in Windows 10 after a recent update? Well, we're going to try and show you the most common fixes for this problem. First, we'll need to right click on the Windows icon or click Windows key and X. Here we can find Device Manager. Start the Device Manager. Inside the Device Manager, you can find the display adapters. Expand this. Here we can see I have two graphics cards, an Intel and an Nvidia one. We'll first try to fix the problem with the Intel one. To do this, we will right click on it and select uninstall device. Then we'll check delete the driver software for this device and click uninstall. Now your computer may behave a little bit funny when you do this. Now you'll need to restart your computer. Computer is now restarted. We'll now launch the device manager again by right clicking the Windows icon and selecting it. Or holding Windows key and clicking X. Here we go to display adapters again. Here we can see the, here we can see the Intel HD graphics again. We right click on it and select update driver. We select search automatically for drivers and it says that the best drivers are already installed. We can now right click this and select properties and see what driver version we have. If it updates the drivers or if it tells you that you already got the best drivers, there should be no problem. If there is a problem, go to your laptop or computer manufacturer's homepage and select a display driver there instead. And if the newest one isn't working, you can try and install an older one. I've got tutorials on how to manually install uh, Intel drivers if you'll need to. If this did not solve the flickering issue, you can go to NVIDIA GeForce uh, page and install uh, display adapters there. I can show you how to do this. Inside Device Manager, look for the Display Adapters tab and expand it. Go to the home page in the description. Use this site to make sure you get the correct drivers. Select your product here. Make sure that your graphics card corresponds to the numbers here and you'll get the correct drivers. Then you'll need to select your operating system if you have Windows 10, 64 or 32 bit. Inside the properties you can find system type 64 bit. Here you can select the Windows driver type standard or DCH. Do not select DCH, then you'll get a very bad version of an NVIDIA control panel and it probably won't work very well with games. So select standard and select all. In this list here you can find the latest drivers. Always go for the uh, most recent driver. If that doesn't work for some reason, do select an older one. Click on this and click download. When the file is downloaded, run it directly from the browser or go to Downloads and run it from there. Just click OK. Now, the driver installation will start. Now you'll get the first choice to install NVIDIA graphics drivers with your GeForce experience or without it. Select NVIDIA graphics driver only, agree and continue. On Install options, you can select Express or Custom. We will select Custom. We will select a clean install since we had some issues. This will uh, set all NVIDIA settings to the default and we'll need to do some setup if we do select clean install. If you do not have any problems, you do not need to select clean install, but we will do a clean install in this tutorial. We check that and click next. It will remove all of the previous drivers and install the new ones. And as you can see, it just finished. Now we can just click close. In some cases, the flickering screen issue is only present on some home pages or some applications. If this is the case, note which applications that cause the flickering. Inside those applications, you can try and turn off hardware acceleration. Like this. Some people have also reported that certain apps like iCloud can cause flickering on the screen. 
If this is the case, try uninstall iCloud. Now I haven't experienced this issue myself, but a lot of users have reported that certain services cause the screen to flicker. I will show you how to turn these off. Hold Windows Cli and click R as in Roger. Here write in ms config. Click enter. Go to services. Sort the services on name. Here you can see Windows Error Reporting Service. Uncheck this box and click Apply. Also stop the Problem Reports service by unchecking it and clicking Apply. Then you'll need to restart your computer and uh, after you've done this, it does stop the screen flickering for some people. Hope this will solve the screen flickering issues for you. If it did, please leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you in future videos.